14 dog adventures run boy run everything you need is here under the sun everything you need is here under the sun we think there's a bunch of hungarian partridge in this strip they come here to feed on the second day we went to a high plateau to hunt hungarian partridge i got dixie and millie out for a truly unique experience to hunt in an area and a type of cover that we had never hunted before. Boy, this is just beautiful up here. What we have here is an old wheat field that, that has been left fallow. It was wheat last year and it's just left fallow this year. As you can see, some of this wheat re-germinated this year wild. It's just classic Hungarian partridge cover. We're inside of an old corral, John. How long has it been since this has been used? It's been at least 20 years since this has been used. It's from the days when this was a big uh, cattle and sheep ranch. And they have these old corrals out on the prairie to, so when they needed to doctor a cow or something, it was handy to bring them in and corral them. Also, when they were doing roundups and brandings. Beautiful, the Old West. The Old West. Millie's feet are raw, and uh, I just was talking to John, and he said there's little cactus here. Out. Trying to keep the dogs out of them. And sure enough, right there, I would say that Millie probably stepped on one. So, something to keep an eye on when you're doctoring your dogs a little. You can see she wants to hunt, she wants to go. So, we're heading back to the truck, but there's not a whole lot we can do other than just get her back to the truck right now. After chasing some Hungarian partridge, having some sore paws on our dogs, we headed back to a creek bottom for some upland action on some pheasants. I got some fresh dogs out and we headed into an area that they called the Lost World. This is called the Lost World. Farthest part of the ranch, good wheat field over here, great cover along the creek. We expect the birds to push out in front of us a little bit until they get to that pinch point over there, over by the greasewood. Then we'll be able to catch up with them there and hopefully flush them all right there. Here. Nice shot, Jeff. Nice shot, Jeff! That's why a water dog is nice, right there. That was a good shot, you bailed me out. It went up so high, it was right, and was then it- tough, tough shot. That was know. tough, that was a beautiful shot you made. Look at this retreat, Look at that. Look at that. Good dog. Here. Here. Come here, buddy. Pick it here. Right here, buddy. We're in the part of the ranch they call the Lost World. And it is like a lost world down here. We put a few birds down. We found two. We had one get away on us. But had some great dog work. Boy, did the birds come out of those. And hunting along a, uh, the river like we were, it was really neat. Lucy did a great job. Pickett did a phenomenal job. And uh, they did not disappoint. We're going to head in for lunch try to pick up some more pheasants and more hunts. Stay tuned for more high flying adventures after this. Come on, pick, let's go. Hey, if you like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash sportingdogadventures TV. Right, Scarlett?